विद्यार्थी मित्रांनो आज आपण इत्ता सहावी विषय सामान्य विज्ञान यातील प्रकरण तिसरं सजीवातील विविधता आणि त्यांचं वर्गीकरण या संदर्भात माहिती मिळवणार आहोत डायव्हर्सिटी इन लिव्हिंग थिंग्स अँड देअर क्लासिफिकेशन या प्रकरणासंदर्भात आपल्याला माहिती मिळवायची आहे The structure of a plant, the flower. The flower is an attractive part of a plant. The flower is an important means of reproduction. The stem, the height, shape, size depends upon the stem. The leaf, the leaf is flat. It plays an important role in the production of food. The fruits, fruits have different shapes. Fruits contain more than one seeds. The roots, the roots are an important part of a plant. It grows downward. need for classification of plants up to now information about lakhs of plants have been collected the diversity in plants they are classified for the sake of convenience on the basis of the similarities and differences in their structure their organs and their characteristics The scientist Carolus Linnaeus made the first scientific classification of plants. Initially, it was his method of classification that was used by all. classification of plants we can easily notice the differences in the shape and height of plants in our surroundings it is easy to classify the plants on the basis of their observation trees plants grow tall their stem or trunk is hard and strong they have branches height above the ground they bear flowers and fruit for many years plants are called trees trees are tall big and perennial they live for many years
shrubs some plants grow close to the ground they give our branches very close to the ground they are shorter and smaller than trees they have a thick and hard stem the oleander hibiscus lantana coranthi and rose are shrubs that grow that may grow up to 2 or 3 meters herbs herbs grow 1 to 1.5 meters tall the stems of herbs are green and quite flexible herbs may live for a few months up to 2 years according to the size and height of their stems plants can be classified into three types trees shrubs and herbs vines the stem of a creeper is very flexible soft and green it grows rapidly with the help of a support annuals biennials perennials the life cycle of plants like jowar sunflower is completed in one year these plants are called annuals the life cycle of plants like the carrot beetroot is of two years they are called biennials shrubs like the hibiscus and oleander and trees like mango gulmohar live for several years and bear fruits and flower they are called perennials flowering plants non flowering plants plants that bear flower it's called flowering plants the plants that never bear flower it's called non flowering plants plants may not have organs like roots stem leaves